Hello, welcome to Healthy Cooking 101. My name is Caroline Weber and I'm the Nutrition Promotion Coordinator at the Health Education Resource Center. Here at AIU, we are in the midst of football season and along with that comes tailgating and game day parties. But these menu items tend to be high in fat, sodium, cholesterol, as well as low in fruits and vegetables. The recipe we're making today is mini pepper nachos and this uses a pepper instead of the tortilla chip. Peppers are a good source of vitamin A and C, and this recipe also provides the extra benefit of added vegetables. So let's get started by washing our produce. In a medium bowl, we're gonna mix together two thirds of a cup of corn, two thirds of a cup of black beans, two thirds of a cup of pico de gallo or your favorite salsa, and one medium avocado diced. Going ahead and give all of those ingredients a mix. You can season the mixture with salt and pepper if you'd like. This is gonna be the filling for our nachos. And next, we're gonna start to assemble the nachos. So you're gonna wanna cut the peppers in half so that they make a little mini bowl. You can remove the stems if you like or leave them there for Appearance. Next, you're going to fill the peppers with our mixture. So the next ingredient is going to be some sort of cheese. So we have cheddar cheese. Um, the recipe calls for one cup. And next, you're going to broil for two to four minutes. It's been about four minutes and our pepper nachos are finished broiling. You can add the additional toppings of diced green onion and cilantro, and there we go. In just about as much time as it took to make traditional nachos, we have this healthy alternative. Try this at your next football game gathering. The next Healthy Cooking 101 is November 3rd at 6.30 p.m. in Clem Hall. You can register by going to our website, www.eiu.edu backslash H-E-R-C.